The holy month is almost over with barely a couple of days left. As with the beginning of Ramadan, the moon is watched with anticipation for another one of Islam's biggest celebrations, Eid al-Fitr. This is the beginning of a new year for Muslims. Eid al-Fitr. Al-Fitr means to the break of the fast, which is the breaking of your fast. So therefore, it is the very first day right after Ramadan has ended, and now you are actually breaking your fast and you're not fasting anymore. So you cannot actually fast. Even if you have days to make up, you cannot make them up on those uh, that day particularly, Eid al-Fitr. So Ramadan is actually month of care, month of self-cleaning and community cleaning, a month where persons will start to put his whole year in perspective. And this is what give us a good start. Look, we made a stop, we changed our habits, now we are moving toward a practical part of it where we are putting things in proper perspective so we can start after Ramadan with a fresh mind, fresh body. It's a big day of Thanksgiving. Many individuals purchase new clothes for the celebration, while most women would get elegant henna designs done on their hands and feet to beautify themselves. Henna has been used for its medicinal and aesthetic qualities by women as part of various celebrations since the Bronze Age in the Eastern Mediterranean and is a popular tradition for many cultures. Because we are celebrating the holy month of Ramadan, we have here henna, um, with the Sheikh Mohammed Center for Cultural Understanding and it's just a way of celebration to get everybody's spirit up and uh, happy. Uh, originally, before it was used for beautification, it was used to cool down the body because what happens when you put henna on, it actually cools down the body. It has its own uh, mechanism of working, a natural remedy. So they used to use it for uh, when people used to have fever and other things like that. Afterwards, it became a, a form of beautification because it dyes the skin. So it would be as if it was a temporary tattoo. So things when people uh, would get married or there was a special occasion, people would use it as a form of beautification. And it actually is very good for the skin and leaves the skin feeling very soft. 